I'm going to go ahead and launch the new instance. Use the Amazon Linux 2 AMI 64-bit at x86. The free tier is selected, review and launch. Launch that. I'm going to create a new pair, just in case it's needed, we're going to call it Republic. And from here we're going to launch the instance. View the instances. Currently pending. I'm going to go ahead and reload. I'll connect to the instance and connect as the default user. We'll clear the screen. Go up the directory to home and then make the new directory. We're going to go ahead and add the user. We'll add a password for the new user. And confirmed. We're going to change to the etc folder so we can update the home folder for the new user. And now we're going to go ahead and update that password folder. Head down to the new user. I for insert. I'll switch that out to Star Wars. Then escape, colon, write, and quit. And then clear. To verify these changes, we're going to go ahead and switch users. Enter the password. Go home, check the present working directory. And that verifies that we have indeed changed the home directory. Switching back to the default user, clearing. We'll go ahead and add our desired users group. We'll change to the home directory and then change to the Star Wars directory. We're going to go ahead and make the required assignment directory here. Next, we will make the required assignment file. And then verify their creation. Gray for file, blue for directory. We're going to go ahead and change permissions to, to the uh, file. So, So Chewbacca now has the proper permissions, and next the directory. And verifying. So now we should have the proper permissions. Next we're going to change ownerships for the file and ownership for the directory. And verify. So we have changed the file ownership. Next we're going to change group ownership. So we're going to go ahead and do rebels will own the file and they will own mm -hmm. the directory as well, which is Vader. And go ahead and verify. So now the files meet the assignment requirements. We will switch to the required user, typing in the password.
And we'll go ahead and clear the screen and initiate the commands for the proper output. Thank you for watching.